welcome to all myself s raghu assistant professor working in automobile engineering hindustan college of engineering technology coimbatore today i am going to take at the topic about engine cooling system the function of engine cooling system is a functional cooling system should be able to remove heat at the fast rate when the engine is hot engines are cooled during the starting much cooling is not needed to working parts can reach their working temperature in the short time purpose of cooling system keep engine at its most efficient temperature and it combustion process the temperature of 2200 degrees celsius coming to wall of cylinder in is 182 260 degrees celsius this temperature should maintain more heat should not be absorbed by cooling system up to 35 percentage of heat there are two types of cooling system one is air cooling system another one is liquid cooling system the two wheeler single cylinder engine having air cooling system the multi cylinder engine cars like car buses are having liquid cooling systems first one what is meant by air cooling system or air cooling air cooled engine metal fins are extended to cylinder walls and engine exposed to air surround the fans are used in some engines only engines are open not grouped water cooled engine coolant used in this system and coolant circulate around the cylinder walls it takes the heat by convection process coefficient of heat transfer is higher in the liquids coolant is a mixture of water and antifreeze solution the water cooling system consists of a radiator cooling fan water pump hoses thermostat valve and multi cylinders how it work this picture represent as how the liquid cooling system works before that parts of liquid cooling system a radiator pressure cap a fan belt and coolant pump water jackets thermostat valve and hoses and coolants water jackets open space between outside and inside valves of cylinder the coolant circulates free freely around engine hot spots and it includes valve seats at guided and the upper parts to lower parts so this picture uh, represent the water jackets water pump the impeller types of water pump and centrifugal pump placed at front end of the cylinder block and back to radiator it can circulate 28393390 liter of coolant per hour it consists inlet outlet impeller and bearings and seals the centrifugal construction shown in figure and water pump engine fan to pull air through radiator it improves coolant at slow speeds 4 to 6 blades and variable sp uh, speed fan and flexible blade and uh, electric fans radiator heat exchange device a most important part of the cooling system it holds large volume coolant in close uh, contact with the large amount of air cords and pipes it let tank and uh, sink and down flow and cross flow expansion tank a separate plastic reservoir under recovery tank connected to the overflow and coolant is engine is expands and surge tank in advantages to the use of an expansion tank is that it eliminates almost all air bubbles from the cooling system transmission oil coolers thermostat valve the thermostat valve device is a wax pellet having and 80, 85 to 90 degrees celsius it's placed the passage from the cylinder this is a thermostat valve open position and closed polish position radiator pressure cap sealing and pressurized condition 
antifreeze solution and antifreeze is a chemical additive which lower the freezing point of water based liquid lowers and corrosive resist and maintain small viscosity to water and then methanol and methyl alcohol propylene uh, glycol 5% of additives so temperature indicates balancing coil cage and indicator lights thank you for watching video thank you